Hello everyone, welcome to yet another exciting Bai K-pop haul and thank you so much once again to Bai for sponsoring this video. I've worked with Bai a few times in the past now and it has always been such an amazing service to use when searching for K-pop items to add to my collection. Bai is basically a Japanese proxy service that allows collectors like you and I to purchase items from sellers in Japan that normally wouldn't be available to collectors overseas. Basically, you purchase items through the Bayou website. Bayou will then purchase the item from the seller for you and have the item shipped to their warehouse. The items will then be stored at their warehouse for up to 30 days, and then you can consolidate your items into one package and have them shipped to you like I have here. I recently created an updated how to use Bayou video, which I will link up above if you'd like to learn more. I also created a shop with me using Bayi video recently that you can also check out and I will link that down below. And thanks to my partnership with Bayi as well, I have a link in the description box below that will get you 1000 yen off of your first purchase if you are a first time Bayi user. So without further ado, let's get into this haul because as you can see, we have a lot to get through. <laughs> All right, so I'm just gonna move this giant box out of the way so we have more room to look at all of the exciting items. Okay, so I'm gonna start with larger items like this one that are most definitely albums as opposed to photo cards, which is very exciting. I did pick up a few albums this time, and as you can see here, I do have a 17 album. So this is obviously one of 17's older releases, but it was an album that I didn't have yet. So I decided to kind of go through Bai and find some albums that I don't own. So I'm gonna need a knife for this. I don't believe this album came with any inclusions. I'm pretty sure I just bought it as an album, which is fine by me. I don't need any inclusions, um, but don't quote me, I don't, I don't know. Here we go. So here it is. It's kind of hard to find these albums in decent condition. I know that a lot of them get sun damage and like, you know, this one has a couple dents here and there, but honestly, I'm not that picky. I just wanted to have one for my shelf. So yeah, I don't even know how to open this. I think it, yeah, it's a magnetic clasp. Okay. So we got some inclusions. We have this little like stamp sticker set. We have this postcard. We have this postcard. We have this postcard, all very cute. I don't think there's gonna be any photo card inclusions though from what I remember. Oh, that's cute too, I like this. I've literally never seen this album in person before, so very excited about it. Um, but yeah, we'll do a quick little flip through. It's very old, so no need to do a full unboxing, but yeah, definitely no inclusions here, which is fine. I knew that going into it. And the CD is just in there, super nice. So yeah, I'm just happy to finally have this album to put on my shelves since I didn't have it before and all of the local K-pop stores in Toronto at least don't have it to buy brand new. So there is that. And next up I have another package that definitely has an album in it as well as some other inclusions which is exciting. So here we go, this is actually very well packaged so let's just, oh I don't need a knife. Okay, so as you can see, oh, I was like, wait a minute, what's going on here? This is the cover I'm used to. We have Woozy's cover for Semicolon, and for those who don't know the story, I have mentioned it a few times, but I joined a group order for this album, and the group order manager has gone missing. I don't know where they are. They are not, I, I have tried contacting them. They are nowhere, so I decided to just go ahead and get a copy of this album through Mercari like I should have done from the beginning. Um, and if I ever get that other album, I'll just end up selling it or something. But here we go. There are some inclusions that we'll look through in a minute. I have literally not seen this album yet. So yay, look at all the woozy. This makes my heart so happy. The only reason I joined a group order was because I wanted his cover specifically and I know it was random. Um, but again, I didn't think about just going through Mercari eventually, which I just really should have done. So I'm glad I have it now. Here is the CD, super cute. I'm just gonna, I guess you just kind of pop it in there. I don't know, but that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> There's that. Oh yeah, cause it didn't come with the little slip cover, which is fine. If my other one comes with it, if it ever does come, I will steal the slip cover and yeah, that's it. But it did come with some inclusions that I needed. So that's exciting as well. 
I did end up trading for the photo cards. So I don't think I bought one with photo cards, but I did get some other inclusions that I needed. I actually don't, oh geez. I actually don't need this little circle guy. Somebody gifted him to me. Um, so this is gonna be an extra that I can put up for sale. Uzi's face is gonna be a problem because everything's not gonna focus. Um, and then we got this little sticker, cute. We have some other larger inclusions, all of which I don't believe I have. So this is very flimsy. I don't think it's a sticker, but here we go. with This little cute card. And then we have some other inclusions here. We have this little unit. I didn't want to collect these. Like I marked them as not needed on my wish list, but hey, it came with one of them. So I will keep it. And here we go. We have Woozy and Vernon. Super cute. I love the... Uh, typography and the overall graphic design for this album. Such an upgrade from Hengere in my opinion, obviously. Um, and yeah, I'm so glad that it looks so nice, but I'm also sad that it took me so long to own it, <laughs> but it's okay. Um, and we also got this giant oval thing of Woozies as well. Oh no, oh no, it's stuck. There we go. We got this thing, super cute, love that. And then I think we got a postcard as well. Oh, maybe more than one. I don't know what this is. Maybe it was just protection. We'll see in a minute. But here is a full group postcard. Nice. And then this is a little, oh, a little like folded poster thing. Cute. So that is all of the inclusions that this little album came with that I bought. So again, no photo cards, but it's okay because I've already <laughs> traded for them because I was just sick of relying on this group order. So let me just get all of this out of the way rearranging some of these things when we get more items but that was another one of the albums that i got i think there is a few more next up we have this album here and it is super reflective so i'm going to stand back a bit but <laughs> as you can see it's not 17 it is xo we do have a little note on the front which is super cute i can understand it there's some loud noises happening i think the garbage truck is here <laughs> but we're gonna power through so let me get this out I thought this album was sealed for a minute, but it is definitely not. Now, I think I purchased this for inclusion, so let's see. I also don't have this version of the album. I wasn't planning on it, but I figured, what the hell, let's just do it. So, firstly, we have this little booklet, which I love this cover. Um, I don't know if... Oh, okay, there's some inclusions, but I think this was just the little lyric book, yes. And it looks like the inclusions are in here. So, we do have this Shumin postcard which i love this album smells so good i wish i wish um these videos had smell -o vision or something because yeah and then we also got his photo card so there it is so i now have two of the schumann photo cards i do need a few more still um looks like we also got these postcards which is interesting i don't think i knew that the album came with that and then we have the photo book. Again, there's so many. Oh my god, it's so loud outside. There are so many unboxings of this that I'm not going to do a thorough one. But here's a little flip through. It's gorgeous as per usual. So yeah, there's that. Let me put this back together and get it out of the way. Okay, I think the garbage truck has finally left so we can continue. So next up, I have the last album that I have purchased in this haul. And as you can see, it is another 17 album. This is another one that I didn't own and also another one that's kind of hard to find in good condition. And again, I haven't really ever seen one of these in person before as my, you know, local K-pop store hasn't had one. I, I don't know if my friends have them on their shelves, but I've never seen it. And I was not expecting it to be this teeny tiny. Oh, I thought it was like dented, but I think that's like the shape, which is kind of cool. But yeah, um, I wasn't expecting it to be this small. Again, I don't think this one has any inclusions, but we'll find out. So I guess first up we have this little photo book. Again, just going to do a quick flip through since this album is old as hell. <laughs> um, then we have, I think, a poster. I, I think. Yeah, it's a giant poster. I'm not going to open it up, but that's that, which is cool. And then we have the CD itself. So yeah, no inclusions, but again, I knew that going into it. So there's the CD. And now I have at least one version of every 17 album on my shelves which makes my heart very happy because that was the goal for this year and we've achieved it so there's that next up i have a few more larger envelopes so it's probably more of a larger inclusion thing than 
you know, an album. Again, I did open all of these already just to make my life easier in this haul, but yeah. Okay, so as you can see here, we have a little uh, Taman advice thing, and there's a little note here. It says, I hope that something wonderful will come to you. Well, something wonderful definitely just came to me, so <laughs> thank you so much, but here we go. So I did buy this little envelope of payment inclusions from advice because there is a photo card in here that I need. Um, I don't remember if there's other inclusions in here that I needed. I wasn't planning on collecting all of the postcards or anything, so it might be a dupe. I don't remember. Um, like a dupe to the one that I already have from my original album. I think the photo card is still in there, but we have this poster, which I don't remember if I have this one or not, but it's gorgeous. So love that. Oops, Schumann, come back. There's that. And then we have this postcard, which feels familiar. I don't know if it's the one I have already. It might be, but that's fine because my main purpose was to get this photo card. And it is this one, which is so cute. So in my album, I pulled the one where he's standing a little further away. I needed this one and his other selfie. So this one is in this haul and I have already purchased the other selfie as well, but it'll be in a future haul. So yeah, I don't know why I'm putting it back in there, but we'll put Tim in right there. How's that? Cute. All right, I think I'm gonna run out of room on this desk very, very quickly. So next up we have another larger envelope. And in this one, this confused me. So I opened this the other day. Like I said, I opened them to make my life a little easier while filming. And I did not order these. So I don't know if they were given to me as a freebie, but they are some, um, what's it called? Eyes One photo cards. And they're like four of the same ones from the D-Icon magazine, I guess. And then there are these as well. I don't collect Eyes One. Um, but I think Carolyn collects this member. I don't know. So I'm going to message her and see if she wants them. And if not, I don't really know. I don't know if these were sent to me by mistake. I really have zero idea, but here they are. <laughs> I'm just going to set them off to the side. Um, but this was definitely my order. And it says, thank you so much, Mercari. <laughs> um, so yeah, let's see what we got in here. We have this Dehan from Wei postcard. I'm not collecting any of the postcards, but it just so happened to come in this little set. So there is that. And then we have a few other items as well. All right, so we have a few more Daehyun items. We have this little clear card. Again, not an item that I was planning to collect, but it came in this set. And then we have this little, uh, it's bent, but it's this little like ticket thing. Again, not an item that I was looking to collect. I believe I just bought this set for this one photo card. I don't remember how much I paid for this set, but for me to pay for it for just one card, it must have been like three or four dollars or something. So there's that. I'm kind of not struggling with this collection, but I'm just finding it harder to find like sets with multiple cards in them, if that makes sense. So yeah, I think that's probably why I purchased this. It was probably like three dollars and I needed that one card. So there's that. Next up in the larger envelopes, we have this which is just one photo card, but it was in a nice large top loader, which is probably why it was in a larger envelope or they ran out of small ones. I don't know. <laughs> Doesn't matter to me. Here we go. As you can see, it is a P1 Harmony Kyo photo card. I don't remember if this is a Wonderwall one or not, but I thought it was so cute. It's not going to focus because woozy, but there he is. And yeah, it is a Wonderwall one. I really loved the photo cards that they released for this Wonderwall um, I don't know if it was a fan sign maybe, but super cute. I got a different one in a previous haul and then there's this one and I believe I have one more Kyo photo card in this haul somewhere. So there's that. Then we have one more larger envelope. And again, it's just for one little photo card. So they must have run out of um, smaller envelopes, which is totally fine. I need a knife for this one though. Here we go. Ah, uh, yes. So as you can see, we have a Shimin set with this Bai haul. I did try and complete as many of the Shumin photo cards that I was missing from my wish list as possible. So I found this set. Um, what album is this from? I don't remember and I don't think it's this. <laughs> so you guys can tell me or I'll write it down below actually, but look how cute. I always love to try and find 
uh, sets on Mercari, so like anything that comes with more than one photo card. It doesn't always work, especially when you're like closer to completing a collection. It's kind of hard to find the last remaining ones that you need all together in one set, so you kind of have to buy one at a time. But things like this I enjoy, like just, you know, you save on the, um, like the service fees and everything because you're buying multiple things in one order, if that makes sense. So I always do try and find sets wherever I can. Next up, we're gonna start opening some of these smaller envelopes and I have a fat stack of these small envelopes. Um, I can actually, you know what, let me show you. So this is how many more items we have to go. It's gonna take a minute. I'm definitely gonna run out of space and so we're gonna start double stacking or I can move some of the larger items out of the way. You know what, let's do that. Okay, so I have moved all of the larger non-photo card sized items off to the side and now we can really continue. So first item in the smaller envelope, here it is. As you can see, it is AT's. And the photo card that we have is this Yasung. Oh my gosh, so cute. I can't remember again which uh, fan sign or pre-order benefit this is, but I will write it down below. But it was one of the few that I was still missing. So there he is. Then next up, we have a little bit of a surprise. I don't know what's in this one. I need a knife. Yay! So as you can see, we have the coveted Jungwon teddy bear and Hypen photo card. This is one that I've wanted really badly. Obviously, I think it was one of those cards that everybody was kind of just like, oh my god, I need it. So I found one to complete that Jungwon collection. I'm so happy to have it. Then next up, we have another small envelope. And we, we have a Woozy photo card. So I believe this is one of the photo cards that would have come in one of those two albums that I opened earlier. Oh my God, I can't get this washi tape. But like I said, I couldn't find an album that came, cause they're so old now. Like I just really couldn't find one that came with the inclusions that I wanted. I was able to find the album separate from the inclusions. So that's what I decided to do. So here is this woozy, super cute. I think this is one of the cutest cards. I love that it looks like a Polaroid. I love the little face that he's making. Just such an overall cute card. So very happy to finally have that. Then next up we have, I'm uh, not really a surprise. We can see what it is. But again, I think this was another inclusion that would have come in one of those albums. And as you can see, it's yet another Polaroid style photo. Again, such a cute one with that little popsicle. And yeah, even the back looks like a traditional old Polaroid. I love it so much. So happy to have that as well. Some of these woozy cards have been on my wish list for a very long time. As you can imagine, because the albums are hard to find, so are the inclusions. So whenever I find one, I get very excited. I think there's two more older woozy cards that I need to find and it's just been very difficult. Um, you can check my Instagram if you think you have them. I would definitely be willing to purchase. So yeah, check that out if you can. And then next up, we have a surprise. Oh, there's the other Kiwa I was talking about. So excited because he looks so cute. Let me see, is this also Wonderwall? Yeah, okay, so I bought three different Wonderwall photo cards of his because I literally thought they were the cutest. I needed them. Um, I don't want to go like too crazy with pre-order benefits for P1 Harmony or fan sign cards, but I don't know, these ones just spoke to me, so I decided to get them. Look at that. Ah, such a cute card. Love that. So there he is. And then next up, we have, oh, another one of Woozy's cards that would have been, oh my gosh, it's the same seller too because this washi tape is insane. I'm gonna try and cut it this time. But yeah, it's one of those cards that I would have been able to pull from that album if I were able to find a sealed copy or a copy with inclusions, but I could not. So had to buy them separately, but that's okay. So here is this one another cute Polaroid style card. Love it. So there is that. And then next up, we have, ooh, this one is definitely a surprise. Here it is. It is another Schumann card, and this one seems to be from a winter special. 
super cute. It's definitely one of the older ones. So yeah, like I said, working on that collection very heavily right now. And then next up, we have, oh, yet another Schumann. There's going to be a lot of him in this haul. Just a fair warning. I kind of went a little bit crazy. So here is this one. I love how like extra protected a lot of these cards have been though. It's great. So here is Shimin, and this is from The War Coco Pop, aka probably one of my favorite EXO releases apart, uh, yeah, apart from Obsession is Coco Bop. I love Coco Bop and Love Shot. I feel like those are my favorites, but there is that. And then next up, we have a surprise. Let's see if I can pull it out without having, no, I have to cut it open. It is the one that I think it is the last Nikki card that I need. Oh my gosh, it's very taped though. So here it is. It is the last selfie that I needed for Nikki, and it is my favorite of the photo cards from this era for him. So very excited to finally have that. And then next up, we have oh, we have one of the cutest cards in the world. Let me get it out of here first. So here he is, this is Hwanung from One Us, and this is from their newest album, Binary Code. I didn't pull either of his cards, and he's typically a little harder to trade for, in my opinion. I've never really been that successful. So I decided to purchase him from Mercari and then uh, either sell or trade the cards that I had pulled, and it worked in my favor. So yeah, win-win situation. And then next up. We have, ooh, we have an only one of card. I'm going to keep it a surprise, but if you watched my last haul, you know what this might be. It is Mel. So if you remember, I bought a Mel cover for their new album, and it was supposed to come with both of his photo cards, but it only came with one. Um, so I had to go and search for this card afterwards, and I found it for very cheap, so it's fine. But yay, so excited to finally have that completed only one of collection. And then next up, we have a surprise. It looks like there's a bunch of photo cards in here, and I honestly don't remember buying a set of anything. Oh, there's one set, but I don't think it's this because I know which package it's in. So, um, what is this? Oh, I know what it is. I know what it is. Oh my gosh, the way those were taped in there was crazy. But I got a full, very, very hollow card set. And the only reason was because I really wanted Gehyun's, but I found this set for $5, the whole set. So uh, where, where are we? This one's going to my friend, Patty. This one's going to Jesse. This one's going to Shelly. And then Kamin and Dongon are going to be, uh, I guess put on my Instagram for her sale or trade. I don't know, but everyone else is accounted for. I decided, you know what, if I'm going to buy it for $5, I can gift my friends their biases. So very exciting. I'm not going to take them out of the plastic right now, just because it'll be easier for me to keep them protected for my friends. But yeah, I'm so excited to have this. I typically would keep like a full set or whatever, but I don't collect everyone. You know, all of my friends do stand very, very. So I decided to gift them a little bit of a, a little something. And then next up, we have something long. It says ATs. I have no clue what's in here. I did buy a few ATs items, but this is not one of the ones that I remember. It could very well be another Yasung pre-order benefit. I know I... Uh, tend to buy them a lot through Baie because it just is so easy. What is this? It is a Yasang benefit. Okay. Is there anything else in here? No. It's just like a folded BTS. Do you see that? It's definitely like, if you look at right, look, look at, I, I read right. If you look at it, it's definitely from the BTS album. That's so funny. But we have this Yasang fan sign or pre, what is it? Global online fan sign event through my music taste. So that's what this is. He's so cute. I love this photo card of him. Oh my gosh. I don't love the way this is designed. And I feel like my music taste has only just recently started um, labeling the backs of their cards. Because you know how Make Star always says Make Star, Wonder Wall says Wonder Wall. I feel like my music taste was like, maybe we should label ours. And then they started doing it. So interesting. Then next up, who do we get? Oh yes. Okay. So 
story time. Remember how I said I wasn't sure if I was going to continue collecting Songhua for their most recent album? Well, I did. So <laughs> I decided I do want to. I waited it out. I waited to find a couple of his cards for cheaper and I was successful. I have another uh, envelope here that has a majority of the cards that I needed. This one, however, this was the only card in that previous order that wasn't in it. So like it had every card of his except for this one. Um, so yeah, I had to find it separately. And then it also came with this one, which I don't believe I need. I think it's already in the other package that I ordered. So I might have a double of this to put up on Instagram, but very excited to actually continue collecting Songwa regular album photo cards only. Um, for Yosung, I will continue to do special things, but for Songha, I will not. But regular album cards, I'm ready to recommit. <laughs> Then next up, we have another small envelope. Oh, geez. Okay, so we have another Schumann um, photo card set, but this is definitely a freebie. I did not order this. It looks like it's from something. Let's see. Yeah, this was not listed in the set. Um, it looks like a little Schumann postcard, maybe from some sort of concert. I'm not too familiar, so don't hate. I really just don't know, but it does have a lot of SMs like older artists on it. So it must be an older postcard, which is cute. I'm going to put it up here with the larger inclusion stuff. And then we can get out this. So as you can see, there's a few photo cards in here. I don't remember buying a big set once again, but let's see what we got in here. So here we go. We have this card first, which is from Love Me Right. Cute. I'm running out of space. We're going to start. Or I guess I could still put some at the bottom. Let's do that. Then we have another one, same album, cute. And then we have this, which I think I do remember actually now from the listing. It is from the Nature Republic, uh, I guess sponsorship or whatever that they had together. So that's cute, nice little bonus. And then this, I don't remember, cute though. Oh my gosh, stop. I don't know what this is from. If it's just a photo freebie, like I don't know. Is this an official item? No clue. Someone let me know, but there's that. And then next up, we have a surprise. Maybe I can cut it with my nail. Ah, we have another Schumann card and it's one that I'm so excited about. It's this cute little teddy bear one from the Universe album. Oh my gosh, one of my favorite cards of his. It's so cute. Ah, I love it. Look at the amount of Schumann here today, guys. Doesn't this make you happy? Because it makes me very, very happy. And then next up, we still have quite a lot of things to get through. So this is a big surprise. Oh my God, it's so light, I threw it. All right, and it's another Schumann photo card. So here is this one. It is from Exodus maybe. <laughs> Again, I suck with older EXO albums. I don't own any, so not too familiar. I joined the EXO game a little late, so yeah, but very cute card once again. And then next up, we have yet another surprise. And it is another Schumann photo card, but do I have this one already here? No. I know I bought one. It, it definitely goes with that one. But I know I bought like one card separately and then I found a set shoot i don't know it, it'll probably come up at some point but there's definitely going to be a dupe schumann somewhere <laughs> and then next up we have another surprise there we go it is another schumann photo card this is another cbx one don't think this is the dupe nope we have not unboxed that one yet so there it is oh my gosh there's so much schumann and then next up we have a bigger item that is also a bit of a surprise. Oh my gosh, I know what it is and I honestly did not need to buy this, but I did anyways. So as you can see, it is SF9 um, K-Contact merch. I don't need this, like I really didn't, but I saw this photo and I could not help myself. I have yet to see Zuho, so I don't know if I'm gonna buy it as well, but look at that. He's both cute and other things at the same time <laughs> and I couldn't leave it behind, like it's just, Oh, it's so, I love this. I love this so much. I'm going to put it with the larger stuff, but oh my God, I'm glad I bought that. <laughs> and then next we have another surprise. Oh, 
here it is this is the dupe shipment so i bought this one on its own and then i found this set so i was just like whatever i will sell this one or something but that's okay with me i don't mind too much so there we go and then next up we have a really cute little baggie and you can kind of see the photo card i'm sure you know what it is but oh, i love this except it can be really difficult to get this top loader out of here oh there we go so as you can see it's juhan and it is the one of a kind oh my god it was a pre-order benefit which store shoot i don't remember i'll write it down below but it was one of the ones i wanted the most because i just think it is stunning look at that i love that it looks like a playing card i love that it's holographic there's the back of it i think this card is just stunning so had to have it there's that and then next up we have another surprise it's another schumann photo card and it is oh is it a little it's a little it's damaged lovely i might have to repurchase this one it is definitely falling apart can you see that no you can't because it's not focused but yeah i'm not happy with that at all so i'm going to have to find another one um but yeah yeah it's 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 not good that edge is really bad so what can you do but it's a cute card <laughs> um i will have to try and find another one i'm gonna put it down here and then next up we have this here we go what's inside oh ah uh, yay so this one i bought knowing that it was damaged but let's see if we can find the damage because it wasn't that bad i think it was that do you see how there's another photo card imprint on it that kind of damage doesn't bother me at all it's more like that one that was like clearly torn that bothers me there's a siren i'm gonna wait so yeah this kind of damage doesn't bother me um i did recently trade for this card but it got lost in the mail so i decided to try and buy another one and for whatever reason <laughs> lino is a little expensive on um on the japanese market so um when i saw this one that was marked or marked at a lower price because of damage i was like okay i'll get that one and uh i'm kind of glad that i did because honestly when that's in the binder you're not going to see that at all so happy to have that i'm gonna have to start double stacking then next up we have this here which is very well packaged so see there's always little japanese notes that i can't read and i really wish i could because they always look so cute but yeah here we go so as you can see we have a little bit of a daehyun set like i mentioned earlier this that other set that i had bought um didn't come with a lot of cards but this one did and we also got some more postcard things so here is this one i actually really love this style of postcard where one of them was sitting in front of the microphones and everyone else was kind of cut off in the back i just think it's so conceptually strong if that makes sense but gonna keep that up there and then we got maybe a poster thingy i don't know but here it is super cute like i said i don't collect these larger items for wii Eye, but happy to have them and then we have the little photo card set so here it is oh my gosh there's so many things okay where do we begin let's start with this one so there we go this is one of the photo cards that i was missing of his i think there might be like one dupe in here i can't remember but there's that again i'm gonna start double stacking then we have this one which again is one of like the more polaroid style ones that i wasn't planning to collect but it's super cute so happy to keep that then we have another photo card here super cute again like i said i there might be a dupe in here for like one that's already in my binder i don't know this is already definitely a dupe of what's back there i think it looks the same to me so there's that but like i said i don't collect these either so that's okay and then we have one more of the polaroid again it's super cute so maybe i do want to collect these i don't know or i'll just keep the ones that i have here because i have them but again i think i just needed those two photo cards that photo card back there so yeah that's why we bought those little sets then next up we have this little schumann set here i don't know if it's a set or if there's just other random like freebies in here i don't remember so let's see what these are first it looks like they're just like I guess little sticker meet and greet things cute i mean i don't need them but hey we always appreciate a freebie but then we have the photo card here that i purchased 
and I don't know what album it's from, but it's super cute. So there's that. And then next up, we have, ah, okay, so there's a story behind this. <laughs> I definitely joined a group order for these, and I forgot that I did. So I don't need these, I already have them. So they're going to be going up on my Instagram as well. That's my bad. I purchased them, and then like a day after I did, I'm like, wait a minute. Didn't I already buy these off of somebody else? And I had totally done that. So here we go. These are the Make Star. I don't remember which Make Star. There's like Make Star A, B, C, D. I really don't know. But yeah, I already have these. <laughs> so definitely going to be putting them up on my Instagram. Then next up. Aha, here it is. The exciting Songha set that I was talking about. It literally came with everything except for this one card up here that I was telling you about. So yeah, this other one that I said I might have already had in here, I did. So I will have an extra Songha to put up for sale or trade as well. But here we go. These are packaged really well as well. And I, honestly, for the amount of Songha that you're getting in this package, I think it was a very good deal. I don't remember how much I paid for it, but I wouldn't have bought it if it wasn't worth it. So here is this one. And again, it's so much better to find larger sets. So you're only paying that buy -e fee once. Like, yes, I could have found them all maybe like one or one card at a time, two cards at a time for cheaper. However, paying the fee every time doesn't make sense. So in the long run, you know, getting a set like this, even though it might have been pricier all at once, is cheaper in the long run. So here's this one. I love this one so much. Then we have that one, which is the dupe. So I'm going to put it on top of the other one. And then we have the other top loader that came in this letter. Here it is. So we have this one, which I think is absolutely stunning. Probably one of my favorites of his from this era. We have this one, which is very similar to both. Well, not so much that one, but similar to the one that I was missing. So there's that. Then we have this one, beautiful, and this one, which is also stunning. So yeah, within that package, we have a full Songha set for this album, which is so exciting for me considering um, I was able to just do it all in one shot. And then next up, we have a bit of a surprise. And it's the Jungwon Lenticular from Inhypen's new album that I needed. So there it is. I love these lenticulars because it's literally just eyes opening, eyes closing. And I kind of find that a little bit creepy, but I love it. So there's that. There's the back. Super cool. We're down to the last two envelopes. <laughs> I know this video is very long, so I apologize. Um, but here we go. This is the last Jihoon photo card that I needed for Treasure. Um, and yeah, now my Yoshi and Jihoon collections are both complete. So there is that. You are my treasure. Super cute. Love that card. Happy to finally have it. It was a struggle to find it for a decent price at first, but we did it. And then the very last envelope is... Ah, uh, it's the other Hwanoon card that I needed, as well as the other kind of character card thing I needed. So firstly, we'll look at the little character card thing. So in one of my albums, I actually pulled the other half of his face. So I just needed this one. So I'm happy to have that. And then we also got the other photo card that I needed. So I think he's probably, oh no, he's over here. He's a little buried, but not really. He's over there. But um, I found this set first, I believe. And then I found that card later. So we were able to complete Hwanung in this haul as well, which is so exciting. But yeah, that was everything in this buy haul. I mean, you can see all of the photo cards here, but also here we have a stack of some of the albums I got. I know you can't really see it, but I can't move it into frame. It's too far away unless I do like a little, there you go. Now you can kind of see it, but yeah, um, what a fantastic haul. I've completed so many collections. I have made a huge dent in so many collections with these. Um, I don't know if I've started any collections. I don't, I don't think that's the case here anywhere, but oh my gosh, such a great haul. 
Thank you again so much to Bai for continuing to work with me and sponsor these videos. I hope you all enjoyed it and that you will also go and check out Bai. Remember, I do have a code down below that you can use if you are a first time Bai user. And I do have other videos as well. I will link them down below um, that you can check out to learn how to use Bai, what Bai is all about, and all of that fun stuff. So. Thank you once again for joining me in a huge haul. I know this video was so long, so if you made it this far, congratulations. I hope to see you in the next one, and yeah, bye bye